Yo, how's it going you guys? New Age here with another showdown lettering session. <coughs> um, before we get started, I'm gonna say I am most definitely sick. Without a doubt now. I know it. It's happening. I was doing horrible yesterday. Today I'm not so bad, but I'm just chilling at home all day. And I will say I have not spoken the entire day up until now, so... We'll see how it goes. <coughs> we'll see how much I can say without talking. Seems all right so far, but today we're up in PU again. Like I said last time, I might uh, do PU again <coughs> just because I want to try. George Bandit though, Drio. Looks like so much fun. Whoa, 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 whoa. Why does this thing have no attack, bro? Well, that would explain what happened in the last game when I tested it. <coughs> I was like, where's Dodrio's power? Anyways, we got Choice Band Dodrio, uh, Evil Light Quilladin, Quilladin, <coughs> whatever you want to call it, with uh, Spikes and Taunt, Speedy. I've never used a Speedy one of these. It's weird because it has speed, but it's adamant. I don't know. It doesn't make any sense. Um, Evil Light Mistrevious with Nasty Plot Willow. Uh, Life Orbs of Streaka, usual set. Stealth Rock, Sash Explosion, Soul Rock, and Shell Smash Gorbis. Um... <coughs> Zebstreaka was a normally, um, was a normally, it was, um, originally, I think that's what I tried to say, um, lightning rod to prevent volt switches because the team is somewhat weak to electric, um, more so to keep Dodrio safe, <coughs> but I realized two things, one, Dodrio for the most part comes out either to sweep or as a revenge killer, so it's not going to be in a position where um, where they're firing off a lot of electric moves at our Dodrio. Two, same thing goes for Gorb. It's not really a revenge killer, but if I'm going to send it out, it's going to be when it's time to sweep, not really at other points in the game. Um, so it's really like focusing on this core right here. And one of the games I was in was against a jump bluff, and I realized I have no sleep absorber on my team. Um, so like, uh, Kulatin could have taken a sleep powder, yeah, but then it just gets blown back by like acrobatics. Not that everyone runs Jump Pluff, but Kulatin is not exactly the best, uh, sleep absorber just because a lot of the Pokemon that have sleep either have flying moves or poison moves as well, which Kulatin does not take well. So I figured Zebstreaka is a better switch in, um, it outspeeds Jump Pluff can hit it with overheat. It also outspeeds and can hit things like Roselli and stuff like that. <coughs> I think Roselli is in this tier. Anyway, so that's why I changed this to Sap Sipper instead of Lightning Rod. I just felt like it was better that way. So anyways, let's find us a game. All right, we got a game. Um, it took a bit. <clears throat> this is actually really scary. Um, Rampardos. <coughs> I don't really know what Noctowl does if all the same stuff um sorry about my phone uh he has a shelter that's pretty interesting uh i really i think just want to lead with zeb Strika. it has like an amazing matchup against everything on his team and can just volt switch out on other things so definitely start with that he's gonna lead maywell it doesn't even matter uh so it's probably rocks maywell um how much can i do to maywell actually <coughs> zeb Strika. Meanwhile, err, and you, wall breaker. Ooh, even a defensive meanwhile. We just kind of blow back. Does he have a? Unless he's like flash fire Flareon, which I can volt switch on. I'm gonna overheat. All right, so he is um, flash fire Flareon. I don't think that matters too much still. Um. And I didn't get the special attack drop, so I want to see how much uh, might be choice banded. <coughs> Volt Switch does a decent amount, <clears throat> not as much as I'd like, but damage is damage. Yeah, that's that's actually that might have been a max roll. Yeah, that was 36 to 43, not even bad. Um, 251. Our Soul Rock actually outspeeds this thing, which is pretty cool. Um, and he doesn't have a flying Pokemon other than oh my gosh. Then, uh, Knockdowl. Let's see. 
Saw Rock. <coughs> Not Dowl. Let's see. Ooh. Stone Edge actually has a chance to kill, so I'm gonna go for that. As he stays in, Flareon goes down, so that's pretty chill. Um, since this Soul Rock is, like, speedy, I might even have a chance to get up my rocks. <coughs> Breaking Sashes on maybe Rampardos, maybe Shelter. I don't know what he's running on those. The only ones I can imagine being sashed. Um, this is sketchy. There's no way I do that much to Shelter. Especially if he's, uh... What the hell? Oh. <laughs> it's like 8,000%. That was to a level 5 shelter. Alright, if he's Eviolite, this can do over half the explosion. So I'm definitely going for that. As he is sashed. And he's going to shell smash. So... <coughs> Let's see. If he's Jolly and a plus 2... 196 speed. Yes. I don't like this. Okay, hold up. 196 times 2? Yeah, that's definitely. Because mm. I would have to go Dodrio here. Oh, it doesn't look like they carry Ice Shard. Ice Shard wouldn't knock me out anyways, so this is the only form of priority on my team. I have to go for it. <coughs> so we're going to do that. As, yeah, he either does not have Ice Shard or chooses not to go for it. So we get rid of the Shelter. That's pretty cool. Uh, we don't get Rocks up, but, I mean, we're not insanely weak to... Or his team is not insanely weak to Rocks. So this is actually an opportunity where Ampros could come out and Volt Switch, but... Um, another thing, I don't know if I mentioned this when I said that I put Zebstrika as Sap Sipper, is my team is actually less weak to Electric than it is to Flying, I think. I have more Electric Resist in Zebstrika itself and uh, Quilladin than I do Flying Resist. <coughs> so he might just get up rocks here. Um, yeah, Quilladin's not even faster. That's why I should be Jolly. Uh... I think I do just want to go Zebstrika. He still doesn't have a fire resist. <coughs> he could get up rocks, that's fine. Um, yeah, clicking overheat again. You can do whatever. I am actually going to change this to Jolly. Because I was like, looking at the speed stat, like 57, I'm like, that's such a weird like bracket. What is that even at speed having it at max? But if he is Jolly, then he outspeeds uh, Maywow. So, you know, good to know. Just more stuff. So we do blow back this Maywow, just completely gone. It actually didn't even go for Sucker Punch, which is a little weird. Um, <coughs> Cause, I don't know. He at least could have got damage off on me. Zepstrika is pretty weak, so Sucker Punch probably would have done a nice chunk. <coughs> Especially cause if Rampardos gets weakened, I'm pretty sure I could just come in and click Thunderbolt a bunch. It should one-shot Noctowl and do a decent amount to Rampardos. I actually want to see. I mean, I know I'm at plus two right now, but... Rampardos. Damn, Vol Switch does so much. I might even be able to... Yeah, it, there's a chance I could actually one-shot him with Volt Switch next time I come in. <coughs> Um, let's see. Who don't I need? I feel like I really don't need Quilladin. Um, because last time I bowed at Ampharos, it had HP Ice, and that did way too much. Not Rock Slide, I mean. Uh, I, HP Ice did a lot to me, so. I'm just going to stay and let him take me out if he wants to. Um, I'm pretty sure I could just knock him out with Thunderbolt. Yeah. Thunderbolt does... Hold up. I want to see minus two volt switch. Well, switch actually did less than it should have. So I want to make sure. Like, say he's max HP. Substrika's so Thunderbolt has a good chance to kill. I hope it does. 
I mean, I guess if it doesn't kill, I don't have that big of a problem with Knocked Owl because Zebstriga is not going to beat Ampharos anyways. So I'm just going to click Thunderbolt. <coughs> As he's going to switch into Ampharos. Okay. I mean, we get damage off on that thing. Um, And I think I'll just Volt Switch. I guess going to Misdreavious. That's like my only answer for this thing at the moment. Um, try to burn it. Possibly. Ampharos is really bulky in this tier. It's crazy. Let me see how much Dodrio does. Return does like 78%. Oh, really? 66 to 78. I mean, we just went first, so... Uh, I'm not going Dodrio right now, but... <coughs> I could. Oh my gosh, yeah, he went for Power Gem. Alright, um... I am just going to go for Will-O-Wisp here. This will keep him in range of uh, return. So I like that. As he doesn't get the paralysis, so that's cool. So now I can just... I think I'll just Shadow Ball. It doesn't really matter if he goes Knocked Owl, because I think I outspeed it anyways. Pretty sure. So we get damage off, that's for sure, in range of return. Um, how much does Volt Switch do, actually? 19. Alright, yeah. <coughs> um, 229. Alright, I don't know how fast he is, so yeah. Uh, we could just go for knockoff too, actually. That'll probably take him out. Yeah, 42 to 49. Alright, so I'm going to go Dodrio. Um, I'm going to click knockoff. That covers if he wants to switch into Rampardos as well. <coughs> But I think I just have a sack in uh, in Gorbis, if anything. How much does this do to Rampardos? 63 to 74. Oh my gosh. So it actually doesn't kill, but... <clears throat> Let's see. I have to be careful with Zebstrika, though. As he goes into this now. Actually, no, I'm fine. I'm going to knock off because then he's in range of Zebstrika's Thunderbolt. And I just click Thunderbolt twice. Oh my gosh, it dies to knock off. Or, well, I had a chance to knock it out. It did 63 to 74. But yeah, that's going to be GG. <coughs> Damn, that does a lot. As he goes for the Hyper Voice. And we're just going to click knock off again. Okay, well. GG still. Not even bad, Dodrio coming through in the end. So yeah, like I said, that's how the team basically functions, is saving Dodrio or Gorbis for the end and just cleaning up. Uh, so that worked out pretty well. Let's find another game. Alright, we got another game. Um, damn, I was going to say, it looks like Dodrio can like kind of destroy this team, <coughs> but it's really bulky. Like, what the hell? Why is this team so bulky? Um, I also don't have a way to get rid of hazards, so Toxic Spikes could be... a a little annoying um and i'm pretty sure i'm not faster than roselia huh i like leading zipstreaka so much i think i might do that again this time yeah i'm gonna lead zipstreaka he's gonna lead roselia um as i thought he would Which is a little unfortunate. Um, so I wanted to see 166. I'm looking at the speed, my bad. <coughs> Alright, so I mean, if he was offensive, then we wouldn't outspeed him, but Quiladin probably could outspeed him, which is kind of what I wanted. So that's a little unfortunate. Um, but like I said, like he's weak to. Like, I can't really do anything to him. I'm just going to overheat right here. <clears throat> as he's probably going to get up both layers of Toxic Spikes. So, that's really annoying. Um, but I'm going to Volt Switch here. Just to get up my... Um, <coughs> just to bring Dodrio in. Um, so, that way it'll just be normally poisoned. And otherwise, like, Mistrevious and Solrock aren't affected. I'd rather have Dodrio regular poison than toxic. So he's actually going to synthesis here. Um, 
And I want to see how much Dodrio does. Yeah, Dodrio knocks this thing out. I guess I should have led with that. Um, he doesn't have a flying resist, so I'm definitely going for this. I mean, he does have this as like a bulky Pokemon to go in. Oh, that's right. Dodrio is a flying type. Herp! He's Rocky Helmet. <coughs> and Recoil. Oh, okay. I was like, what was the first thing I got hurt by? Um, definitely going into Soul Rock here. Yeah, so I guess more of my team than I thought isn't even affected by, uh, by, um, Toxic Spikes, so I'm kind of chilling. Um, <coughs> I don't know if he wants to just get up his rocks here or what. I'm really debating just, well, it sucks because his team is so bulky. So I can't really just start setting up like that, you know? I think I want to go Mistrevious and try and burn him. Yeah, because I didn't think he was attacking there anyways. And our team <coughs> is actually pretty weak to uh, Stealth Rocks, which is a little annoying. I don't like teams that don't have hazard control, but we're going to try and make it happen. As he's going to go for the Dragon Claw there. Um, I think I actually want Nasty Plot. He doesn't really have any uh, ghost immunities or whatever either. Was he Lumberry? Okay. Alright, he's not. So he's probably like Eviolite. Mistrevious versus. <coughs> Goodbye. Shadow Ball at plus two. This is a two hit KO. I'm going to go for that. As he's going to go into Roselia. Nice. Yeah, I wasn't about to like do that a uh, second time. Nasty plot again. If he wants to go into Audino, that's fine. But yeah. I'm gonna knock out this Roselia right here. He for why is he forfeit? Hello? <laughs> I don't think he was gonna get swept by that. I mean he had an Audino, like I don't know. So normally Mistrevious runs HP fighting, but mine had Thunderbolt. I mean, plus two would have done a decent amount. If it couldn't touch me, I could have set up to plus four, and it would have been close to a 2-8 KO. So, all right, whatever. If he just wants to forfeit, that's fine. Let's find another game. All right, we got another game. Um, this one looks a bit tougher, actually. And I feel more like this Lightning Rod Zipstreaka. Also, Golem, again, with, like, the... Uh, I should be faster than Golem. I'm gonna lead with Kaladin and Taunt. <coughs> yeah, I'm definitely faster, so I'm gonna Taunt this man. I did not know Kaladin gets Taunt. That seems like such a random set. As he's gonna switch out into Ivysaur, so that's chill. Um, I'm gonna get up one spike, cause that's kind of all I need. Um, as, oh, he can't even touch me with a Sludge Bomb, that's right. Hey, Bulletproof, Bulletproof coming through. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna get him more spikes then. <laughs> Sup, bro? Uh, this thing can't sludge bomb me either. I don't know what he wants to do though. I kind of want to go out in a soul rock, but I know this thing gets like dark pulse too. And I don't want it to like coil on me. What is what does the Viper do in this tier? Makes attacker. Oh, flamethrower? Flamethrower, huh? And Giga Drain. That's sketchy. Um, I I don't really want to go Soul Rock here. I don't know what Mistrevious can do though, especially if he has Sucker Punch. <coughs> All right, I'm gonna go Mistrevious. As he's gonna glare at me. Oh, that's annoying. That's super annoying. I'm gonna attempt to Will-O-Wisp. Or actually, no, he's probably like sh Shed Skin. I mean, Infiltrator would be better and make more sense, but it's whatever. As he's gonna crit knockoff and take us out. That's bananas. All right, let's see. Uh, <coughs> I feel like he might have a... Uh... Is he Life Orb? No, he's not. Thunderbolt has a chance to knock him out. I don't really want to take that chance. Actually, hold up. 
Dodrio though. Dodrio definitely knocks him out. With like Brave Bird. It can knock him out with Return too. I'm gonna try that. It's not as high of a chance to knock him out like if he has HP, but I definitely would rather go for that. And Sucker Punch doesn't knock us out. <coughs> because then, um, I guess he has less of a flying resist on his team, but um, I don't want to be taking the recoil just yet. Especially because I could definitely put in work towards the end. So we do knock him out, and we don't have to take any recoil. He could go into Golem here, uh, definitely. But at least his sturdy will be broken, so we don't have to worry about any weakness policy. We can just um, knock him out. <coughs> I don't know who I want to go out into, though. Can't really go Gorbis. I don't want to go Zepstreka either, because I don't want to take a Sucker Punch. Um, so I'm leaning more towards Quilladin. Let's see. Golem definitely gets one shot by that. <coughs> yeah, because I don't want to take a Sucker Punch with Zebstrika. Actually, I feel like I need Cool Autumn more. Does Zebstrika knock him out with HP Grass? Hidden Power Grass. Yes. Alright, let's try that. I mean, if he attacks us, then it's not as bad, but he's definitely just going for rocks, which is a better play. Um, I guess he could go into his own Zepstrika if he is... If he is really predicting HP Grass like that, I don't know. <coughs> I mean, otherwise, it's like, why else would I go out into this, you know? Okay, so he stays in and just goes down. The crit didn't matter. He didn't even try and sucker punch. I don't know, maybe he was thinking I was trying to double predict something, but nah. Um, I do have to be careful. Okay, he forfeits. <laughs> um, <coughs> I think he still had a shot, for sure. Especially because my Dodrio was... Uh, Dodrio's not faster, is it? Yeah, my Dodrio was banned and not Scarf, so his Zipstreaker definitely could have put in work on my team. Because I'm not even Lightning Rod, so I don't have any Electric Immunities. Um... And a lot of my team is weak to electric, except Quilladin, which he could have overheat for. So, he definitely had a chance there. I don't know why he just left, but it's whatever. Let's find another game. <clears throat> Alright, so he has Stunfisk, so I'm guessing that's his lead. Um, I'm just going to lead with Quilladin. <clears throat> he actually leads with Lampant, so that's interesting. Um, I am faster than him. He can't hit me with a Shadow Ball, I think. That's bulletproof, right? Yeah, Shadow Ball. <coughs> he can't hit me with Shadow Ball, so we'd have to trick or go for a fire move, which is, you know, obviously an easy thing for him to do. Um, I'm just going to go Soul Rock here. Because he, he has to go for a fire move or switch out. If he tricks me, I don't care as much. Um, I would want to get up rocks, but it's not a huge priority. <coughs> I feel like it would be good for, like... Uh, Ponyard. I don't know if it's Sash. It'd be good for Lampet and uh, and what's it face bird over here? Un pheasant. He actually goes for Shadow Ball. Hello? What are you doing, man? You know you can't touch me with that, right? Like what if I stayed in there? Alright, Lampet. Do you die to Earthquake? Do you die to Stone Edge? Uh, better chance at that one. Okay, and we miss. <coughs> so that's a little unfortunate. Because we could have definitely put him in range, if not knocked him out. So, a little a little lame. Uh, I'm going to go out into Quilladin here. Just in case he's choice, because he's not Life Orb. So I'm going to get up my spikes. Yeah, what are you doing, bro? Like, you can't touch me. <clears throat> um, I think I want to taunt here. I don't know who he's going out into, but it'd be nice to have it be taunted. Yeah, see, so it seemed like this man was just making, like, a prediction, but he really wasn't. He just had no idea. 
That sucks. And we didn't even get rewarded. We missed the Stone Edge. Not cool, broski. Not cool. And now he's like, oh, what do I do? <coughs> I mean, he doesn't really have amazing switches for this. He has Oon Pheasant. Like, that's it. <coughs> he's going to choose to go into War Turtle. This can outspeed us, but I don't think it can knock us out. I don't think we can knock it out either. Uh, let's see. Yeah, Wood Hammer doesn't do enough. Uh, we did taunt it, so he can't toxic us, but I am going to Wood Hammer <coughs> as we crit him. So that makes up for our uh, Stone Edge miss. Not bad. Kind of. He still has Lampet, which is a bit of an annoying Pokemon. Um, I do feel like he's choice now for sure. Yeah, okay. And now that I don't have a fire switch in. Um, <laughs> let's see. Can I just like try and sweep this man? He's scarfed. But if we're at plus two, we will outspeed him. <coughs> I just don't want to deal with like priority on his team. Let's see, Mischievous. Oh, we take Fireball, or Fireball. <laughs> I was reading Shadow Ball and Fire Blast together. Yeah. All right, we're gonna go Gorbis. Let's see if he has Fire Blast or Flamethrower, which is even weaker, but damn. What is that roll? We will be faster, but then we just die to like any priority. Whatever, let's go for it. My flamethrower do so much. Few shell smash. This is life orb. Wait, is he specs? Cause flamethrower. Oh crap, he's specs. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. If he specs. Then I still don't know speed him. That's annoying. Yeah, I'm I'm shell smashing anyways. As he switches into Blossom. Yeah, that's specs flamethrower damage, so good to know. Um, we do have speed Blossom, and it can't be Evil Light, so <coughs> and plus two Ice Beam definitely knocks this thing out. So whoa, what? Okay. What? Seriously? I guess he's like max bedef. He did not have a good chance to live that at all. <coughs> um, let's see. So he's specs lampant, so that's good to know. Because we can outspeed him with some things. Um doesn't really have a flying resist at the moment. Kind of want to just go Dodrio. <coughs> um, maybe start firing off some Brave Birds. Yeah. I feel like in the end, Zebstrika is going to win this one for us. For sure. As he's going to switch into Stunfisk. You know, not bad. This thing have static? Oh my gosh, it does. I don't want to get paralyzed. Um, who do I go out into here? You could definitely go for the electric move. <coughs> I don't know who's better to go out into here. I feel like I really need Mistrevious. And I can't do much to Stunfisk, honestly. Stunfisk is an annoying Pokemon. 100%. Uh... Mistrievous. All right, well, plus two Shadow Ball can two a KO, but he's gonna be going for uh, discharges here. Stealth Rock, okay. That's actually a little annoying too, but I'm the nasty plot. Pretty sure we're faster than Lampant as well, so that's cool. <coughs> he can discharge; it won't do much. 
And unless he paralyzes us, we can 2 a KO him with Shadow Ball before he can knock us out with Discharge. So, not bad. Nice, easy switch there. How fast is... Hold up. Please don't paralyze me. Okay. Um. Well, that's cool. As he's going to go Blossom. Okay. He's like, you're going to get paralyzed, so I'm going to get a free switch into Blossom. It's chill. You're still dying to this, bro. Get out of here. Um. What do I want to see? Un pheasant. Okay, yeah. Dodrio does outspeed that. And unfortunately now... No, I'm going Kuladin. Okay, as he goes flamethrower. I'm knocking you out, bro. It's a riggedy... Wiggity wiggity rap. <coughs> Catch this knockoff. Oh, crit. Um... Mm. Okay, I definitely don't knock it out with another one. Yeah. Oh, wait. 18 to 21. Yeah, no. Alright. Um, I think I'm going to go Misrevious here. <coughs> and just sack. Or, you know, whatever he wants to do. Why does he have Sludge Bomb? Hello? <laughs> I'm just kidding. That's really weird, actually. Um, I'm gonna Will O Wisp in case he wants to switch into Un Pheasant. Okay. We just can't get rewarded for anything this game, can we? <coughs> yeah, burning that would have been really nice, you know? <laughs> <coughs> Dodrio does knock him out. With Brave Bird. I'm gonna take a bunch of recoil, though. But Zebstrika might be able to win in the end. Okay, well, that's dead. Get out of here, bro. <coughs> I don't know if I could win. Maybe I can knock out Lampant with Zebstrika. He's got to go, like, Ponyard here or something. Which... I don't do that much to, so... Actually, Brave Bird can do 50%. Sucker Punch knocks us out, though. Um, yeah, he definitely got rewarded for things he shouldn't have this game. 100%. Um, Sucker Punch? <laughs> Sucker Punch? Can't knock us out. Thunderbolt does 80 to 96, so I kind of need this to happen right here. Because I don't want to overheat and have the special attack drop. So if we don't get the roll, it doesn't matter. It wasn't meant to be anyways. So we're going to Thunderbolt. Actually, Quick Attack might knock us out and we don't even get the roll. So that's going to be, you know, whatever GG that was. Not really a GG. But I don't mind. <coughs> if all of the luck is against us and we had absolutely... Like, if we make the right plays and don't get rewarded for it then I don't blame that on me playing bad, obviously. I blame that on just bad luck. So if I lose the bad luck, then it's whatever. Because I just think I would have won that game otherwise. But it's chill. Let's find another game. Yo, Furfru? Oh my gosh, I want a team with Furfru. I'm using Furfru next time. 100% and this will probably be the last game too. Um, this is a scary team too. I don't know what I'm doing against this. <laughs> uh, Substrika would be a cool lead because I could Volt Switch for free. <coughs> Maybe even knock him out. Let's see. How much does Dodrio do to Volbeat? Weather support? What? Quick attack does not do enough. Will be doesn't even a uh, flying type. I can knock it out with overheat though. Yeah, I'm leading instead of Shrieker. He's gonna lead done spare C. Well, that can't paralyze me, so that's pretty cool. He might be stealth rock. Uh, uh why does Vice do so much? <coughs> to me, from him. 
Um, I'm just gonna Volt Switch. I'm assuming he's not gonna glare, so okay. He is not defensive. That thing took so much damage. He should Stealth Rock here. Yeah, okay. Um, and I... Why did that do so much on Volt Switch? It makes me feel like Drain Punch can knock him out. But I still want to taunt just to be safe. And hopefully he goes for like Glare or something. Nope, he actually went for Headbutt. Okay, well. Um, I'm going to get up a Spike because that's cool. If he wants to stay in and Headbutt me, fine. <coughs> I'm hoping that's what he does actually. Because then we can potentially knock him out with Drain Punch. Getting up a Spike is cool. Always nice. Get some damage off. Alright. And now we can proceed to Drain Punch. As now he's going to switch. Okay. Well, that's a little unfortunate. That's just bad timing on our part. Um, I, I don't know what I want to do here. I'm going to taunt. In case he goes for like T-Wave or... Okay, yeah. I like this better. Because then he can't Baton Pass. Um, yeah, so he would have to like Bug Buzz here. That would be all he could do. But I'm going to stay in and let him Bug Buzz me. Okay, never mind. Cool. <coughs> well, now I wish I Drain Punched. Because that we would have actually ended up with more HP. But Dunsparcy is gone, so that's cool. Taunt Kulanen coming through. And we're going to Taunt again. Okay. Yo, 29%? I'll take it. Like, <laughs> if you want to sub, please break through here. Okay, so he can't sub on us, so that's nice. Yeah, it's more beneficial for us to just stay in. Because he's going to attempt to Tail Glow and not get rewarded for it. Hey, <coughs> hey. Encore ended. Hey, Kulatan just took out two Pokemon. Hey, as now he's gonna go out into Furfru. I'm gonna taunt. Okay, special Furfru. Ooh, I didn't know that was a thing. Um, I want to get up rocks. I kind of do, just for things like Avalog taking like 25%. That's nice, right? Also, I want to see what this Furfru has. Solrock doesn't do much against the rest of his team, I feel. Surf? What the hell? I'm going to explode. This thing gets Sucker Punch too, though. So he might Sucker Punch me. But uh, let's, let's see. This is the weirdest moveset I've ever seen. Okay. Nah, there ain't no one there to surf, bro. Uh, I think I go Zebstrika and... Huh. There's no way. Yeah, okay. Let's see. I kind of want to try and Shell Smash up with Gorbis right now. Because then we can just kind of go crazy. I don't think he knocks us out. And Gorbis, I don't think, can set up any other time this game. Alright. I mean, he could stop Sucker Punch, so we'll see. Sucker Punch, I'm pretty sure, can knock us out. But we're going to go for... Le Psychic. Yep, that'll knock him out. <coughs> Not bad! And now we're looking, uh... Mighty fancy. If, say, like, Avalog is his last mon left, he can't really do anything. Let's see. Uh, go, go. We actually... Oh, after Stealth Rock and Spike, we should knock him out. But he goes into... Behem. Behem does get knocked out by Hydro Pump, so we're going for that. Yeah, as we miss, okay. Well, okay, then. Oh, <laughs> um, Dodrio, do you knock this man out with knockoff? Yes, you do. Let's do that. <clears throat> huh, things can never be that easy, huh? We can never just 
knock stuff out with hydro pump. Uh, so here, I'm thinking uh, mischievous, right? That's that's the man. That's the man to go out into. Yeah, it's a girl, but you know. <coughs> oh, eating it up. We're gonna go for a will o' wisp because nothing on his team appreciates burn. And uh, another avalanche doesn't knock us out, and he can't earthquake us. He could toxic. You want to toxic us, bro? Oh! Officially eated. We're gonna shadow ball. Okay. All right. I was like, what was that roll, bro? Was not a roll. Um. Yeah, we should win this now. <coughs> I'm just gonna just gonna thunderbolt. And then we're gonna overheat, and then we're gonna brave bird, and then we're gonna call it a day. Let's do it, bro. Damn, he ate that. Oh, he could set up on me here. Oh my gosh. I would hope another one knocks him out. Ah, knocked out. I guess that was his only opportunity there. Granted. I don't know. I mean, damn, that was bulky, though. Hold up, I want to see. Go, go. <coughs> Use that plus one defense. I don't know. He was definitely special defensive if he lived that overheat like that. Because that's what this set comes up as. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, so he would have had to be at, like, plus two to live it from max plus two defense and that was for max HP we already brought him down to half grand he could have healed against us but still not even bad though Drio pulling through working pretty well with Zebstrika got it a bit I liked it Zebstrika and Dodrio put in the work in this game uh, so yeah that's gonna be the live you guys hopefully you enjoyed if you did be sure to leave a like share the video comment down below all that good stuff and until then I'm new age still keep on watching I'll see you guys next time Later.